and this is my learning assessment um, for a week of adoption. Um, so I decided to do the children's literature review. Um, I actually chose a book from my childhood that I hope is still kind of relevant. It was really like my second childhood and they are about three to five years younger than I am. So it's like still a little bit relevant, but it can always be far back. Um, so I chose uh, Stella Luna, um, it is about a fruit bat who loses her family and she is raised by birds. Um, so as a child, I really liked this, um, book and movie. I got to experience both of them. I thought they were super interesting, um, except at the time. And to honestly, um, make the connection till now. Um, that this book was even had any relevance or same underlining theme of adoption. Um, I knew of adoption as a child. I knew it was a thing that happened, but I didn't know anyone until I got to high school. Um, and met someone who was adopted as a baby. Um, but yeah, I didn't know about it when I read this book as a child, and honestly when I was researching different books, um, for this project, or for this assignment, I would have never thought it was. Um, so yeah, it is about a fruit bat who loses her home and stuff, um, loses her home, can't find her family, has no idea that she's even a bat, or like how her lifestyle is, and then this, she's super tiny too, like she's smaller than average. Um, and then this group of birds find her find her, um, and just raises her as her own, teaches them her the lifestyle of just living as a bird, didn't, um, like, continue, or didn't, well, they didn't really honestly know anything of her best, so, like, they couldn't have thought of anything of her lifestyle, um, but yeah, she, like, grew up living as a bird, she knew she was different, but didn't understand what made her different, um, and anything like that, and so, that was part of it, and then as she got older, she kind of found, went off on her own, and then found, um, these individuals like her, um, yeah, so she had no idea that wasn't really, honestly, her true family, they had just raised her up as her own, and everything like that, um, but yeah, that's the basic of the story. Um, I think that this book is really good to be used in ch for children because honestly, adoption, things like that, um, aren't a super common topic to be discussed about. Like, the word is known, but they don't know what it means, how it's done, anything like that. Um, as children, whether it's a child who is personally adopted, a sibling, has a sibling that was adopted, or even just a friend, or just a child who has heard the word adoption. They don't honestly know what that means. Um, so like books like this, or like we, in our module, we also had the book, We Belonged, We Belonged Together, which is about adoption, and explaining why people go through adoption, because this child doesn't have this, but these parents are willing to give it to them. So that's why they got adopted. Um, and then they're just part of the family, like, it's that. Um, so yeah, it's really good to kind of open up that discussion. Again, like, I didn't realize that this was a book that kind of had that underlying theme of adoption. So definitely, like, nowadays, if I were to use this for a child talking about adoption or just deciding to show this, I would definitely express what the theme of it is and have my kids have a discussion about it and if I was working with a kid who was adopted I kind of guide them into a conversation of like how they feel like do they feel like this or things like that like Stella not Stella Luna not knowing her past like with a child does a child feel like that they don't have that knowledge of themselves or if they want that knowledge, do they not want that knowledge, do they just want to be how it is and be raised by the family that they have, um, things like that really opens discussion or a child, 
um, who has a sibling who's adopted, do they know what this means, like, how do you feel about having an adopted sibling, do you see them any different, any less, better, anything like that kind of discussion, anything that they feel open to discuss, these books and books like Stella, Luna, we belong together, can open up those discussions so it's really good to use that, and with the connections to children's rights, just knowing that they're a person and knowing who they are is really important to so allowing them to know that they're adopted at a young age. If they express any want to know any of the history, it's really good to like let that happen or at least give as much information as they want or if you have or just telling them like when you're older you can do like your own research but don't like hide it from them because it can give off identity crisis is a way to express it. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was a really good book. Something that has, it was one that had like that secret little hidden thing in it. Um, and it's always good to, back, to bring back old childhood.